Hey, Magic Mail here, and today I want to show you something that I call frustration. You see, I've always wondered what it would be like to be a professional gambler in Vegas and playing a game like Five Card Stud, uh, where you get one card and then you make a bet based on the card that you get on the percentages of whether or not you had the best hand in poker. And uh, like I said, I'm, with Five Card Stud, you know, you get five cards. And let's just say, for instance, the first card you get just happens to be the Ace of Spades. Well, you know you've probably got the best hand on the table, or at least tied with the best hand on the table, so you're probably going to make a pretty good raise and wait on the second card to come. So when you get dealt that second card, let's just say it just happens to be a Ten of Spades. Well, now, not only are you bringing a flush into play, you're also bringing a royal flush into play. But the odds of that happening are probably pretty slim, so you're probably just going to make a uh, either a small raise and wait on the next few cards to come, or maybe just call at this point. But then, when that third card comes, and it is that second ten, well now you just got a little bit better, and your percentages have gone up pretty good. A pair, ace high, you're probably going to make a pretty good raise right here. And you're going to pray like everything for that third or fourth card to come. And when that fourth card comes, if it just so happens to be that third ten, well now, you're in the ball game. you probably got the best hand on the table. So the odds are, you're probably going to make a pretty substantial raise. And you can even take that ten of clubs out, turn it over, because you really don't care what that fourth or fifth card is, they can all be face down. Nothing's going to get you out of the game right now because you've got three tens and an ace high. The odds are you're raking the pot. But if things seem too good to be true in poker, they probably are if Magic Mel is your dealer. Because you know if Magic Mel is your dealer, you know he's going to deal himself the most unbeatable hand in poker, which is... The Royal Flush. I'm Magic Mail, and that's frustration.